gives it back to Russ. Deep shot. Get it! What a perfect ending to a historic day! Westbrook gives the Thunder the victory at the buzzer! Game against Long Beach State. Now Westbrook. Oh, 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 oh. Jamal Blinken got there. And he just got a face plant from Westbrook. Jamal got Blinken. From an offensive standpoint, he can run the point guard position. He can get into the middle, distribute the basketball. He has great size and athleticism to finish inside the lane. The one area that he's definitely going to have to work on is outside jump shot. With the fourth pick in the 2008 NBA draft, the Seattle Supersonics select Russell Westbrook from UCLA. So after 41 years of basketball in Seattle, the Sonics are packing up the trucks and heading to Oklahoma City. Both the team and the city reached an agreement this afternoon that the city of Seattle was willing to part ways with the team they've supported. He'll take it. Great Look cut it. to the basket. Oh, and recovery by Westbrook. His, How about that? His former teammate, thank you very much. That's a start. Westbrook. It's of the jet. They don't call him that for nothing. Watch out. Oh, my goodness. Wilkins clears out the second quarter. The Thunder by a half dozen. Westbrook. Going right back. There it is. Off the backboard to Westbrook. Wow. You knew it was coming. Some in some form. A poor decision. Westbrook, 100 miles an hour, throws it down. Boy, give him a little momentum and look out below. 74-68, Lakers still by six. Just posterizing everybody. Finds Westbrook, puts it up at the buzzer, off the rim, and the Lakers win and advance to the second round. A thriller here in Oklahoma City and a crushing defeat for the Thunder. Oh, I can never get tired of saying this. Russell Westbrook from UCLA. I'm sorry, Steve, with the nice finish here, the elevation, the extension, maybe next year slam dunk champion. Westbrook all by himself. Yeah, I don't think I was expecting that from Russ. I did not know he had that. A heartbreaking ending to what has been an exceptional season for Oklahoma City. But the Mavericks showing this is a different Dallas team. Poise, grit, toughness, defense. How I feel about Russell Westbrook, who wants to be a bigger star than Kevin Durant. Is a shoot first point guard. It's harder and harder on Durant. I have a bad feeling they can't win with that dynamic. Thompson throws it away. Durant running to the rim. Oh! Oh, there are no words for how nasty these two can be. Oh! For the Thunder. Westbrook now by Sessions. Oh, he put it down! Ibaka. Westbrook. Oh, he loses it! Well, also Westbrook has really struggled offensively in this series, but where's the help defense? He's 16 of 26. Westbrook again to the basket, again he puts it in, and a foul! Russell Westbrook answering every big shot from the heat down the other end of the floor. Just making sure everybody, you know, know that we, we worked hard and we know what this feeling feels like. You know, we, we remember this feeling. And, and that'll push everybody in the summer, just, just trying to keep everybody going and keep everybody heads up. Short on that shot, Durant's got the double-double. Three on one for the Thunder. Westbrook! Cocking the hammer and pulling the nastiest of triggers. Now here's a game of you make the call with Patrick Beverly out of line. Russell Westbrook coming across half court to call a timeout. Beverly goes for the steal and bumps knees with Westbrook. This is the third surgery in the past eight months for Russell Westbrook. The same knee has to become concerned about whether or not this is going to be a chronic thing and, and how much this could affect Russell Westbrook going forward in his career. All game, they both went down together. Look at Russell Westbrook pulling down his 10th rebound for the triple-double. Man, that 10th rebound sets up a bucket by Durant. Rebound, change by Oklahoma City. Westbrook in his pocket. Got it! Got it! Westbrook for three with one-tenth of a second. Thunder on the high side. 
for putting the move on Mills. No. And twist one hole, one of those. As two scores collide. So Danny Green has come back. It was Green involved in that collision. We always find a way to get through it. It's been a long season for myself and Aunt Kevin. We still fought through it and got here. We're definitely not going to give up. Come back next year and be better and be stronger and be wiser. We'll be coming back. God help us all, you know, because I don't want to miss Kevin Durant for the whole season. I'm sure they don't want to miss him for the whole season, but let's just say, what if? Well, then we would find out exactly how great Russell Westbrook really is. What about Russell Westbrook's chances? as maybe a dark horse candidate for MVP because it sort of worked for Kevin Durant last year. Yeah. Westbrook did yeah. a ton of games, 36 games last year because of the knee issue following the surgery. Hey. Oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Russell uh -oh. Westbrook pointers made, which is a new all-star record. Westbrook putting on a show. Matches the 76ers lead at 32 to 17. Westbrook racing. Elevating the two-handed sledgehammer. His head hit the cameraman. Westbrook again. I'm telling you, he's he's just a load. I mean, you can see why he's in the MVP conversation. He's come every way. Me personally, I never want to be able to uh, my destiny and my playoff future in another team's hands. We end up not making the playoffs, which is definitely um, a disappointing season uh, for us around here. But uh, we got to get better for next year and come back with a different mindset. Kia MVP award winner, Russell Westbrook from the Oklahoma City Thunder. Uh, it's a blessing, man. I'm uh, happy to be here, man. Toronto's been great. You know, all the guys have been great. Happy to be a part of you know, Kobe's last game. They don't have timeouts. you got to be ready to play. Oh my goodness. The Oklahoma City Thunder grew up. They matured into their massive talent. They arrived right on schedule. They look like they should be the favorites now to win it all, to win the title. And those dudes in Oklahoma City were led by two superstars who acted like anything but, who choked when the pressure mounted, and as a result may have cost their team a trip to the finals. It's a learning process, um, you know, just like myself and, and Kevin back in 2012. We lost in the, in the finals, and we we know what that fe that feeling felt like. I look forward to him coming back next year and being better. Well, if this one's gonna have to step in sooner or later, as these former star teammates jawing at each other. That's a blessing, man. I'm I'm just truly blessed to be able to play the game I love every night and. Leave it on the floor, and uh, I'm thankful to play the game with my teammates. Never give up, man. We've been in different situations all preseason. We came out and competed, uh, came out with the win. 16 in the second quarter, 13 in the third quarter, and 15 in the fourth quarter. He has totaled a career-high 56 points. We've never seen a player put up numbers that rival Wilt Chamberlain, and Oscar Robertson, no. what they did in their era. No. He's doing it. He's not only doing it, he's surpassing Oscar Robertson. Russell Westbrook is padding his rebound stats. Westbrook ranks dead last in the NBA in contested shots. He doesn't play defense, defend a shot because he cheats to get rebounds to pad his stats. Adams gives it back to Russ. Deep shot. To a historic day! Westbrook gives the Thunder the victory at the buzzer! Misses gets the rebound! Back out Westbrook! Bang! Russell Westbrook from just inside half court! Then it's a one point game! You got a foul. I never thought I'd be saying this up here today, but I want to thank the media. So I thank you guys for. <laughs> For voting for me, no, but seriously, but thank, thank you guys for voting for me. I very, very appreciate it. Um, I feel like I go out every night and compete at a very, very high level. Smartest move by Russ and the smartest move by OKC. I think you have two guys there, two stars in Paul George and Carmelo. Okay, Russ, let's show that you're loyal. Let's show that you locked in and let's see what year we have.
The Oklahoma City Thunder is officially the number two team in the Western Conference. They are, yes, I'm sir. anticipating that they will be the ones to meet the Warriors. Russell Westbrook and Paul George make up the best backcourt in the NBA. You combine that with Melo. All oh, thanks to the man above just for blessing me, man, with my ability to play basketball, do something I love, and I'm just thankful to be able to do it. I'm here in Oklahoma City, man, with my teammates, and uh, just happy uh, I'm able to come something like that. You know he's chasing stats. He's been chasing stats since last year mm. because he knows once Durant left, he was never going to be a, a, a serious title threat. Mm. So what can he do mm. to get that recognition? Mm. Let me get some old triple dub. That's away from Raymond. Oh. Oh. The rim is crying. You want to talk about putting some hurt. The K3 season is over. Utah advances to take on Houston. It wasn't meant to be for Russell Westbrook. On his way out. And he is one assist away from making history. Well, it's easy to underappreciate the career of Will Chamberlain. It's not hard to appreciate Paul George as Westbrook has his triple double. Rebound number 20. The rest of his teammates, you can see them going nuts. Ross very much trying to soak in the moment. And for those of you who yelled stat hunting at the end of this game, yeah, 100%. Russ was stat hunting there. Westbrook wants to push for the Thunder. Spins, kicks, Adams, another slam. Well, you see Westbrook, they evaded one into the right. You Steven Adams was going to be on the floor. If they lose this series, it will be three consecutive years that Russell Westbrook went home in the first round. All the ire and the frustration is going to be pointed solely in his direction. My process always look at myself first, what I could have done better throughout the whole season to put our team position to be able to win games, how I could be better, um, you know, coming back and how I could have did better to help us uh, win the game. Is this a huge hit on Westbrook's legacy? It's a devastating blow. Nobody would ever question Russell Westbrook's ability. Nobody would ever question his effort. What they would question most is his decision making. Westbrook has stayed stuck on the numbers and not necessarily transcended to the intelligence part of the game where you need to really be the quarterback and the leader out on the floor to make your team win. It was time to start the rebuild and Russell Westbrook just really didn't fit that type of timeline for this Thunder team. So it became very obvious for both sides. They were motivated to get it done and both the Thunder and Russell Westbrook and his representation made it happen. These two guys do not make sense playing together. When the guy does not have the ball in his hand, they're not doing anything. It's as simple as that. Russ is a horrible three-point, horrible three-point shooter. Chased down by Westbrook. Westbrook and Harden back together. Beautiful combination with Westbrook. Slams it home. P.J. Tucker all over Ingram. Now a steal. And Westbrook is on the freeway. Go towards Harden. Russell, nice pass inside. Westbrook accelerates and scores. Puts it down. Then he mean mugged the whole crowd up under the rim, and I know the Lakers fans like that. Now they are back this time. Here's set. Oh, Russell Westbrook! A spectacular dunk, and it's a two-point game. Clear athleticism of Russell Westbrook. He didn't turn out as planned, uh, but you know, there's so many things and so many different obstacles that we, as a team, had to overcome. Not a bad year, but obviously not the way we want to end it. This was a trade of two players on two teams who wanted to go in the other direction. Russell Westbrook wanted to be in Washington, reunited with Scotty Brooks, play with Brad Beal. He's like drop step for the second time tonight. It will take Bonga too. Simmons looking for the foul on Westbrook. It goes on call. Eyes was coming over for that help. As we take a look at Westbrook. The fadeaway. And there it is. History, Russell Westbrook has just surpassed Oscar Robertson. It lasted 47 years, and now Russell Westbrook stands there all alone. 40 seconds to go. Westbrook, the hesitation. Oh, the monster jam by Russell Westbrook, and the foul. Oh my gosh. We should be proud of the, the way we played this season. We, we fought through a lot of ups and downs, adversity, injuries, COVID. 
So we should be proud of the way we, um, as a team collectively, you know, fought. That's a good team on the other side, and we you know, good luck to them. Being in this league, when you know teams that actually want you and actually want you to be a place, at that point, it's my job to be to make sure that I come in and do what I'm supposed to do, and that's to come in, compete, and make sure that we have a chance to compete for a championship. Russ likes to play fast. LeBron likes to play slow and deliberate. Both yep. LeBron and Russ are ball dominant, and Russ has never been accused of the guy that makes the best decisions. Their big three can't really shoot. The hesitation, the drive. Pass deflected out to Westbrook. Westbrook drives, tried to jam it, he missed it. Rebound Harden. LeBron James felt like which he was, wide open in that corner, but you can't blame Westbrook. Frank, you um, opted to go uh, with Russ on the bench at the end of the game. What were you, what, 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 were, what were you looking for there? What was the thinking behind that, behind that choice? Yeah, playing the guys, I thought we were going to win the game. Westbrook off the glass, badly misses. You hear the groans from the crowd. He's hearing some boos. Westbrook thought about it. Crowd kind of telling him no, and he missed it. Can you kind of take me yeah, through just, what was going, what just was going on there? Give encouragement. Just keep their head up. Keep playing. Tough night. Um, and I told him I wish I could help him. Unfortunately, I wasn't in the game to be able to help him. The Lakers do that when they traded for Russell Westbrook. $47 million owed him next season. There's very little ability to do that. And and in a trade, you want to know that you'll be better. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Bro, I'm out, man. That nigga's tripping.